In this video, we will show you how to replace your rear lift glass support. On this Lincoln Navigator, you'll find this on your rear tailgate. Let's get into it. All right, friends, let's get started on our job. Since we're going to be removing the lift support, you wanna make sure you're holding up the glass with something so it doesn't fall down and potentially hurt you. We'll just put this little rod in here. That'll hold it in place for us. And now we can continue up along the top. Now in this area, you'll find that you have a pin that comes through from the inside all the way through the lift support and comes through the outboard side. There's also a small clip in this area that you're going to have to remove. You're going to be reusing it, so you don't want to lose it. We'll use a small pick to get into this area and gently pop it out of place. Grab onto that. This is going to be a little hard to see. I'll grab it with the magnet. There's that clip. Now we're going to remove the pin from this area. It's common for it to be stuck in there. If it is, you're going to want to carefully use a hammer and punch and gently drive it out of position. There's that pin. We'll clean it off, give it a close inspection, and set it aside. Now we can grab onto this, give it a little wiggle, and try to separate it. If it does not want to come apart, just give it a couple taps with your hammer. Obviously, every time we're using a hammer around glass, you want to be extremely careful. Now let's follow this all the way down to the bottom mounting point. In this area, you're going to find that you have a clip that you can easily remove using either a pick or a small screwdriver. We'll just gently pry this out of position. While you're pulling it away, we can go ahead and give it a little tug and remove it from the vehicle. And there it is, friends. Clean and inspect the mounting areas. All right, friends, let's get ready for our installation. Looking at the top of the lift support, you can tell that you have one area that's larger than the other side. You want to have the larger area facing towards the back of the vehicle. Slide that in there. Continue on with your pin. Slide that right on through. Once you have that through there, continue on with your locking clip. Now we'll continue on with our locking clip. This will be easiest to install with some long nose pliers. Slide it right into the groove on that pin. Make sure it's completely secured. Make your way down to the bottom. For the bottom, we'll just press this in. You can watch that locking clip. Once you hear a click, give that a tug to make sure it's secure. Let's remove that support and test its functionality. As long as it's holding the glass up, go ahead and do the exact same thing on the other side of the vehicle. Aside from that, thanks for watching. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.